In the Russian town of Yaroslavl, some 250 kilometers north of the capital Moscow, a local zoo is experiencing what its officials are calling a white baby boom. Just a month after an albino kangaroo made its first public appearance from its mother's pouch, zoo-goers have again been delighted with the sight of a newly born albino fawn. The three-week-old fawn, which belongs to the fallow deer species, was born with light fur strands in contrast to her protective parents, who bear a chestnut coat with white mottles. We have had the birth of this unusual baby. The whole time that I have worked at the zoo, we have always had the same ginger sweethearts, but this year we have this white miracle. Albinism is a hereditary condition that is caused by a lack of coloring pigments in the skin. In animals, it can lead to a lack of pigmentation in the eyes, fur, scales or feathers. According to zookeepers, albino-born animals would struggle to survive outside the zoo because their albinism would make them more susceptible to sunburn and could also mean they have poor eyesight and are more likely to catch the eye of other animals. This year is very remarkable for us because we're experiencing not just a baby boom, we're experiencing a boom of white babies. It all started with a white baby kangaroo, an albino, then white lion cubs were born, and now a birth of a white fawn, an albino that should be a ginger fawn. Zoo officials say the majority of their animals have already given birth for this season. However, some are still expecting. The next animal in line is a pregnant donkey, and zookeepers say they are growing excited with bets if they could welcome another albino baby to their fold.